A robbery at a T-Mobile store. A man and a woman pretending to be customers grabbed a handful of cell phones in Garden Grove and ran. Tonight, KCAL Line's Stacey Butler is live in Garden Grove with the details. Stacey? Oh, Susie, it happened right here behind me at this T-Mobile. It was in the middle of the afternoon. A guy and a girl were working behind the counter when they say a man and a woman walked in. They say nothing could have prepared them for the bizarre heist that was about to happen. I'm just a sale rep, and I'm a girl, and I'm, I'm, I just scare. The second robbery in just two months has employees who work at this T-Mobile in Garden Grove on edge, afraid of when they'll be targeted again. Everywhere you go, you feel like there's something going to happen. Today, just before 3 o'clock, a man and a woman walked into the T-Mobile store in this busy strip mall and pretended to shop. But as soon as the man turned and looked at the woman, security tape shows him ripping an iPhone out of the wall and lunging at the store clerk. Then the woman tried ripping a Samsung phone from the display counter. She didn't have much luck. She grabbed wire cutters from her pocket. That's a really strong cable, but they have, like, strong scissors or something. They cut it off. In the front of the store, the clerk tried to protect the phones. I just tried to stop them. But when he saw the man pull a knife out of his pocket and pointed at him, he fell back and called police. If I'm not calling police, this will be happening again. As the woman kept cutting cables, securing phones, the guy ripped the counter out of the wall to get to two iPhones. The pair grabbed four phones worth almost $4,000, pushed past the clerk and ran before police had a chance to show up. Employees are worried if something doesn't change, it's just a matter of time before they're robbed again. This corner pretty much very like deep in the plaza, so it's not safe in this area. Now, the employees told me that they're really worried, that they hope that something can be done. They don't know what that would be, but they're hoping that a solution is created somehow before the next iPhone launch uh, when they fear that they could be robbed again.